All right, let's look at the one inch equals one foot measurement. And you can see between zero and 12, there are 48 divisions. So I know that's one inch equals a foot. So I know we'll be going from zero to one to two to three, et cetera. So let's look at our first measurement. Our gross measurements here, our object that we're measuring extends past our fine measurement. So I'm gonna to go to the two, number two, and I know that's two feet. So I'm gonna represent that here with a two feet. And I can see that it lands on the one foot, two foot mark, and it's just about even with the two foot mark. I'm not gonna split hairs over that. So I'm gonna call that two feet, two inches. I think I might have misspoken, called that the two foot mark, but I meant the two inch mark. All right, next one. I go to two feet, it doesn't touch my gross measurement, so I have to go to the biggest gross measurement, which is one. So I know this one's gonna be one feet, and I'm gonna put the dash, and then I have 10, 11, looks like 11 and a half. So I'm gonna call this one feet, 11 and one half inches. And that's how you use the one foot equals, the one inch equals one foot scale to do a measurement.